हेलो गाइस टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन एपिसोड नाइन ऑफ एक्स्ट्रा ऑर्डनरी अटोनी वो ड्रामा बट फर्स्ट लेट्स जस्ट रिकॉल वेयर एट्थ एपिसोड एंडेड इट एंडेड विद अटोनी वो मीटिंग हर मदर सो नाइन्थ एपिसोड स्टार्ट्स विद अ न्यू केस अबाउट अ गाय नेम्ड गुपोंग टेक्स द स्कूल बस फुल ऑफ चिल्ड्रन टू अ माउंटेन सो द चिल्ड्रन कैन प्ले विदाउट स्ट्रेस लेटर पुलिस अरेस्ट हिम फॉर किडनेपिंग द चिल्ड्रन Young Woo is briefed by Juno over her latest case. The director of Mujin Academy in which the children go is the mother of defendant Goo Pong. Young Woo and Myung Suk meet Goo Pong, who is in detention center, but he denies to defend. He claims that he is the commander in chief of Children's Liberation Club. Young Woo and Myung Suk feels weird about this, so they coach him what he has to speak in court. But Gu Pong goes with the flow, whatever he has to say, and doesn't listen to his lawyers. The mother of defendant meets with attorneys. They told her to meet the children's parents and tries to settle with them. She agrees. Seeing Gu Pong's attitude about his ideology, attorney Wu tries different approach. She approaches the victims, means the children who went to mountain. First, she meets a girl. Young Wu introduces herself as Gu Pong's friends. Being tied to her study schedule, the little girl excuses herself, but she tells them about other kids and where they can find them. Young Wu and Jun Wu go to a convenience store. The store owner tells them about the condition of children, like about the food habits and the caffeine they are taking daily just to stay awake. Outside the store, a little guy crying over his less score in maths. Young Wu tries to talk to him by introducing herself as Gu Pong's friend. The little boy tells them how he enjoyed the day spent with Gu Pong, and that he wants to liberate it. Next day in court, the driver tells judges that he was drugged by Gu Pong, and Gu Pong also agrees with him. Next day, Gu Pong's mother tries to settle with parents. She kneels down in front of them and tells them that his son is not in a normal state of mind. She apologizes. Court attorney Kwon tries to prove Gu Pong's condition of megalomaniac, but attorney Wu interrupts and tells the court about the locked classes and how the children are not allowed out until 10 p.m. They have to study without taking breaks. Attorney Wu talks about the school system conditions and how the defendant is a political offender who wants to change school system, but that does not go well. While seeing this during recess, Attorney Kwon tries to convince Myung Seok to punish Young Wu, but Myung Seok scolds him and tells him that this is not how he works. There are short moments also where Young Wu tries to be nice in front of Juno. She pulls chair for him and she opens door for him. Juno asks her about why she being nice suddenly. Next day on Gupong's request, Young Wu invites all the kids to the court. Gupong gives a heartwarming message about how life is full of stress and he is attempting to liberate kids who desperately need a break. Gupong starts to play with kids in the court itself. This scene was heartwarming to see and Gupong's mother All at night, Junu rushes to office for confessing his feelings to Young Wu. He tells her that he likes her. Then all Sai Young Wu run away from there as she does not know what to say. In the end, we see Tai Sumi meets Young Wu's father at his shop, and some reporter takes her picture while going inside the shop. That's the end of the ninth episode. Subscribe my channel for further episodes.